Skin retouching plays a significant role in ad films, fashion films and music videos beyond cosmetic enhancement. It ensures that individuals appearing on screen look their best, with distractions minimized. By achieving a polished and natural look, the focus remains on the message, style or performance being conveyed. It allows filmmakers to create a specific atmosphere or evoke certain emotions, enhancing storytelling. Introducing our free skin refining power grade for DaVinci Resolve, a game-changing tool designed to enhance the quality and appearance of skin tones in your film projects. Our meticulously crafted power grade harnesses the advanced capabilities of DaVinci Resolve, enabling you to achieve professional grade skin refinement effortlessly, even on free versions of DaVinci Resolve. The process is pretty simple. We smooth the skin layer underneath and add back the details with the blend mode. This allows us to control the balance between the smoothness and contrast of the fine details in the skin. Let's get into the tutorial. We have our footage right here. We'll start by importing the power grade. As you can see, it's already color corrected and color graded using our LUT. This is before and after the LUT. We'll go ahead and right click on our power grade and click on Display Node Graph. Once we can access the node graph, we'll go ahead and drag and drop the compound node right before the color space transform node. You can see that it has already made our skin smooth. To refine the adjustment, we'll go ahead and decompose the compound node. Here, within the compound node, the details node controls the smoothness of the skin. But before we can manipulate that, we have to make sure that the node skin mask is oriented properly. We'll go ahead and select the skin mask node and click on the magic wand icon. Play around with our luminance selection slider to make sure we've got the best selection of skin possible. We can play around with the hue and saturation sliders as well. Once we are happy with the selection, we'll come back to the detail node. And on the key section, modify the opacity of the node using key output. You can see that as we increase the opacity of this node, the details on the skin sharpen as well. And if we decrease the opacity to zero, our skin becomes extremely smooth. By default, the opacity is set to not 250. For this image, let's set it to not 175. That looks like the right balance of smoothness to me. Let's take a still and compare it with the power grade turned off. Here's our second shot. We'll go ahead and place the compound node right before the color space transform node. We'll go inside the compound node, make sure our skin selection is in the right range, we'll adjust the opacity of our details node. Here's the before and after. Here's our third shot. It's already color graded, here's before and after using our LUT. There are a lot of powerful looks that our color toolkit offers. Feel free to check them out in the description. Let's go ahead and place our compound node before CST node. Let's adjust skin selection and adjust skin details. Here's before and after. Here's our last shot. We'll repeat the same steps as our previous footage. Here's before and after. That's how you achieve skin retouching in DaVinci Resolve using the free power grade. Make sure to check out our film emulation power grade as well. Don't settle for the ordinary. Make your footage extraordinary with our meticulously crafted film power grades. Step into a world of cinematic excellence and captivate your audience like never before. That's it for this video. Make sure to subscribe to our channel, hit the bell icon and check out our Instagram at Colorist Talk Factory to stay updated.